Greetings everyone. Welcome back to another YouTube health video. If this is your first time seeing my video, my name is Beverly. Guys, today I just want to share with you how I made my home homemade veggie wash. As you're aware of, fruits and vegetables are sprayed with pesticide. What is pesticide? It is a chemical used in agriculture to control produce weeds, insect, and so on. Pesticides can cause many health issues, example, allergic reaction, and many more when purchased in stores. If you grow your own, you are fine. So what we need to do, we need to practice smart choices and proper food preparation can help you enjoy the many benefits of fruits and vegetables and reduce the danger or risk of our fruits and vegetables. So regardless if they are organic or conventionally grown, they supply high nutrients, healthy benefits as part of a daily balanced diet. After shopping, Washing and peeling produce makes a difference to your health. So using thyme water, that's what I want to share with you, and white vinegar can help decrease pesticides. So today I'm going to be using one bundle of thyme, as you could see right here, and one cup of white vinegar. Then we're going to add one gallon of water with a steam for 15 minutes. After cool, you're gonna add one cup of vinegar, mix and wash your produce first, then place in a large container. Soak for 15 or 30 minutes, depend on the produce, rinse and prepare. As you could see here, I have strawberry, I have the peppers, I have mangoes, apples, I have blueberries, I have plum, mango etc so these what i did was i prepare one gallon of water into a bunch of thyme thyme is all over you could get thyme all over into one gallon of water so i'm gonna divide this thyme water into two halves i'm gonna add the kale in one and then i'm gonna add the fruits in one. This kale that I have is the organic kale, so it doesn't need long process. You put it in for a few minutes and then you could take it out. So I'm gonna divide this thyme water and add my vinegar and wash my fruits and vegetables. Right here, you could see this is the kale soaking in the thyme and vinegar water. Then I'm gonna move over. Now I'm gonna add my peppers in. So there we go. And I'm gonna add my strawberries in the water. Also my plum, I'm gonna add in the water. You let them sit there and soak. If they are not organically grown, you could let them stay there up to half an hour. You so you do the same thing with your apples, any fruits or vegetables that you purchase, this is what you can do with them to help reduce the pesticide so we could stay in good health. So I'm gonna let you sit there for a while, but the kale, I'm going to be taking out the kale shortly. Now it's time to remove the kale from the thyme and vinegar water. So I'm going to remove, I'm going to rinse again and place it back. Now this is what the kale looks like after I rinse it from the vinegar and thyme water. So now I'm going to go over now to the fruits. So now it's time to rinse these off. After rinsing them off, 
this is what it looks like so now i'm gonna put them in a bowl after rinsing rinsing all my produce this is what it looks like and also when you make your lime and vinegar water you can add it to a spray bottle and some things you could just spray on it i hope you like this video because it's not everyone can afford to go organic so if you cannot afford the organic this is a simple method that you can do it yourself and prepare your own pesticide free produces i hope you like this video please do not forget to share hit the like button subscribe by doing so you helping others to stay in good health keep on doing what you're doing blessings i just want to just share this video with you how i prepare my veggie wash instead of going out and buying things that you don't know how it's prepared you do it yourself and it's less costly this video is for educational purposes because i was i'm just sharing this video is for educational purposes only this video is for educational purposes only thank you for watching see you soon cheers